This is John Racer X here with a mod I've done to my Mamba Rustler. Now the one you see is uh, pretty much a, a factory Rustler VXL. Uh, here's the mod I did to mine. Using a GT8 body. You can see the difference in size. It's not an expensive uh, mod to do. The body was $27 and, uh, and the inside of the chassis, which I did most of the work, uh, that wasn't too expensive either. I think the, ex the frame extension was 30 and the arms for the front were another eight. So uh, let me take the body off and I'll show you what I did. Here you can see it, it's still a rustler, just like the stock one. Put them side by side, they look pretty much the same. And here's where I uh, did a frame extension right here. And there's a plate on the bottom, you can see it right there. That extends it to about two inches or so. I still have my motor and everything. I also added a, a holder for my GPS right there. And here's the front arms, which are the same ones in the back. So it widens it out. The only thing you have to do is drill out the caster blocks to fit the bigger pins. And you're gonna have to shim shim the uh, the caster block because the A arms are a bit wider. You gotta shim it at the caster block and at the uh, bulkhead to make it fit. Another thing I did is I took the body mount off, which would normally be right here, like this one, and I bolted it up front here, so it's still adjustable. And uh, the aft one, you don't use a single one anymore. You actually, you buy a body mount for the slash and bolts right onto the uh, aft uh, shock tower. And that's also adjustable. I took it out one time and that thing handles like a dream. So I think the total cost for the mod was about $70. Uh, I'd like to give a big thanks to Kavi for coming up with the idea of extending the chassis and using that type of body. I think it works great. I'd like to give a big shout out to everybody that runs these wrestlers because it's addicting, I tell you that. Alright, talk to you guys later. Bye.